I'd say starting a nonprofit's really hard. Welcome to the Phoenix Boston. It's a labor of love around an issue that you're heart driven around that at times it feels like the rest of the world may not care as much about it as you do. Welcome everybody, pumped to have you here. In those early days, I just always felt like we couldn't move fast enough or grow fast enough or reach enough people fast enough. When we started in 2006, we always knew we wanted to be a national nonprofit. <laughs> There's the man right there. It was just super hard because people started learning about our program. It's not about who can lift the heaviest dumbbell. It's about doing something healthy and active together. And they wanted it in their community, but we couldn't go there. I think in the early days of my own journey, we were maybe too quiet about what's so special about our program. And the louder we got about it, the more attention we drew from people who also believed in it. We found donors and supporters that believed in that vision. And now we're in over 23 states and over 56 communities, and we're just getting started. You're gonna encounter these times where things get really tough, and you're not gonna believe that it's possible to do what you're trying to accomplish. I'd encourage you just to step back and reconnect to the why. I often will say to staff and volunteers to share their message in a way that inspires others alongside them. The word will get out, and the numbers will grow, and before you know it, it will reach across, across the country.